Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev. Welcome on back to more of the last Aura Crew. And in the last episode, we had just gotten to this point. I did a little running around and exploring to get a decent weapon. And I found superior training, training cantana. All you got to do is just look around. You'll be able to find your way. It's not real difficult. All kinds of crap sitting all over the place. There is... Oh my god! What is it with the stun lock on this? Like whoever gets the first stun lock wins? We got a brute blade, huh? But yeah, you get different stuff each time. And right here you'll find Ooh, that takes a lot to be able to use that one. Oh, where was it? There it is, the volcano sword. I can't even use it correctly because I don't have enough. Oh, yeah, in enough guys, enough stuff. more um, rings in here and in that corner and that's about as far as I got before I got killed Okay, see how long that goes for. Great, a great armor in there. We can't get. Now, supposedly, let's see, we're here. We need to go all the way across to the ship to the fortress. Anywhere close to where I'm supposed to be. I can't even see myself in here. <sighs> That'll just take us right around again. Yeah.
This appears to be the correct way. I shoot with the tool. <laughs> Later, rat dudes. Sorry, I gotta kill you guys, but. That'll take me right up to, back to the top. No, it looks like that dude, when he got kicked off way up there, he's gone. Still, nobody drowned. So, for a first timer, I'd call that a success. Also, for a last timer, I'm never driving one of those things ever again. So, we're still supposed to go to Majesty. Yeah, find the Lady of the Lake. I wonder how we're supposed to do that. What's this map say now? Breach in the tower, and there's a terminal. Okay. More rat guys. Sword nice and super duper. All right, what are we fighting here? I'm sure nothing good. Draining mana. You have received a Dranomit Drainer. Equip the mana drainer in your shield slot, left hand, and perform left primary or secondary actions to hit your enemies and convert their life energy into your mana. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not really a big fan of that, even since, you know, I don't have all that much mana to begin with. I'll make choices, I suppose. An owl ring plus one. 
Yeah, so depending on the kind of build you want, man. Ooh, what's in here? Wow, if that's cobwebs, I hope the spider isn't around. What was that? We have a mission to recover the damn crazy one. It's just you and me. Not a word to anybody. Find me, the lady of the lake. I'm getting you out of here. What's back this way? Oh, that's where we came from. Okay. So it saved us from the spider. Really? F is how you jump? What's up, asshole? Royal Guard, right on time as usual. Why do you always march in when the main fight is over? Is that part of your training? Speak up, Guardsman. And stand straight when you're reporting to your senior officer. Well, Decanus told me that the Royal Guard is a separate force and we should report only to... only to... Ah, that's humiliating. I forgot the name of those ranks again. Anyway, he said we don't report to common military. Oh, he did, did he? Well, screw him and screw the Royal Guard. We are under attack and it's martial law here now. Barrow Bufus is dead and I'm his temporary substitute. So you report to me now, no matter what. Is that clear? Is that clear? Sire, yes, sire. Sorry, sire. I will now say sire in every sentence, just so you don't pop a vein, sire. Always the funny guy, aren't we? If you think that belt of yours will get you any preferential treatment... Uh, not really, sire. I just think it will eventually get me into recycling, sire. Nice that you bring that up. I am in need of someone to use and recycle. <sighs> I have only a handful of men left now, and I can't afford to lose a single one. You, on the other hand... If Regulus and the old legends are true, I can lose you as many times as I want, can't I? I don't like the sound of that, sire, but technically you are right, sire. <laughs> Splendid. So the immortality is a proven scientific fact now. This looks like the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Did you see those rats breaking into the castle? They haven't made any move yet. I suspect they barricaded themselves on the top floor. I can't have them at our back like that. They could strike any time. Somebody has to de ratize this castle once and for all. Somebody like me, sire? Yes. May I just say... No. We need to get rid of those pests first. You only need to know that you have my permission to die as many times as you need. Shit. Dismissed. Sire. Yes, sire, sire. Okay, where is the terminal? It is somewhere this way. Ah!
Captain's Log 103-088-0722. Inspected the results of local terraforming. Our other crew did respectable work getting this planet ready for the Naboru. Field surprisingly well done. Luckily rudimentary security, easy to get in and tweak it. It will allow me to use it for more than just life support. Started already. To gather data faster, repolarize the permeability of the belt's energy field. It is now bi-directional and allows for external inputs. Absorbing the energy of other beings should enhance the capacity of my belt to create new synaptic connections. Hence, faster learning. Marvelous. Ida says it's unethical and unauthorized hacking but I won't be lectured on ethics from somebody who puts the protocols before our needs. We both know our mission is to get the cradle back. I'm not underestimating this. The enhanced ability to learn and adapt will be most useful. Putting down some local animals to obtain their energy is a low price to pay. Aging and hollow help, no progress. Over. Okay. Oh, we can get. Oh no! Oh no! We can we get one more? Doesn't look like a 387 versus 377. Let's do it. All right. That is a sparkling scepter. Oh, lightning, huh? But you gotta have 12. All right, what are we looking at? Two thirty-seven. All right, and there's that amplifying shield we just picked up. Not against bullets, so it's like, what then, when are there gonna be bullets involved? Keep our hands on that, we won't get rid of that, we won't get rid of that. Okay. Top floors up there. How are you supposed? How are we supposed to get there? That's the question, huh? Can I get in here? Nope. Just get me up there. Okay, well, let's go this way. Whoop. It was up. Yeah, we need to be careful now. Still, that's freaking cool looking, man. Gotta give them to them. Developers have made quite the story here, sorts. What's up, beefy? Okay, I saw a door open on the other side. What do you got for me? Alright, good stuff, good for upgrades. <clears throat> oh, a lot of good stuff. Sweet. That'll be the door you couldn't. Yeah, okay. So, back up where we were, and we'll go up the other direction. 
<coughs> what are you two doing? Shit. Come here. Oh. <laughs> See, I just step back, let somebody else take care of it. All right, there we go. Now you can at least see the effect on that one. Closed for a reason. Who asks to enter the sanctum? Um. What happened here? Why are you locked in? We are under attack. The fortress isn't safe anymore. I am not a fighter, and the Ratkins are vicious. Well, I am not a rat, so. I believe you. Still, I cannot let you in before the hallways are safe again. Okay, we just gotta clear the hallway then. Which means going back this and seeing what's this way. Okay, so I killed everything in the hallways. Get another level up. Go. Now I'm gonna have to hold off on leveling just a hair. How did you come back? That was some baby back bullshit there. All right, more guys there. The hallways. Oh. clear up here. Hey there! The door is closed for a reason. Who asks? It's me, Silver. Not that you would know me, but... That is of no concern. Welcome, Silver. Keep a little at your service. How can I help you in these troubled days? 
Do you seek refuge or spiritual guidance? You are Livel. Ha! Great! Can you let me in? We need to talk. That would be highly unwise given the situation. I can only offer distant services for now. Well, the situation has changed. The hallway is absolutely safe. Do you have any evidence to support that claim? Only the Ratkin blood on my hands and the silence. Indeed. The sounds of war seem more distant now. I will open the door for you. Just remember you are entering a sanctum and behave accordingly. I'm gonna steal any and everything I can. <clears throat> oh, the last immortal. I hope you bring me further news. Marco told me about the Queen's arrival at the monastery. What happened next? Oh, Marco was here. Well, some rather harsh words were briefly exchanged, some executions mentioned, and Maltus ended up in prison. Now the crazy bit. As soon as the Queen rode off into the uprising, some weird monster broke into Maltus's cell and killed the guards. So... So I could steal their armor and pretend to be one of them to get here and talk to you, you know? Sure, but... Maltus? Right. Well, the monster dragged him away. He was kicking and screaming something about masters and you and, oh, uh, me being useless. That truly hurts. Yeah, it did hurt. <laughs> Do you think Maltus is still among the living? Probably not. No idea. But I guess the monster took him alive for some reason. It's all just pain and suffering lately. My Barrow, my baby, my Maltus. And me now being the only one left to look for them. Them? Oh, I mean him. Our patriarch. But never mind, never mind. Oh, and Tobias? Uh, well, the situation was heated, and that queen of yours kicks like a mule. <laughs> so Tobias sort of ended up uh, falling off a cliff. All that because of that rod, you know? I wonder why he didn't try to hide it. There was absolutely no way I could have helped him. Mm. Honestly. Oh, I'm a lion SOB. I couldn't help but overhear something about some cradle. Anything I should know about that? No. Marco already knows everything there is to know. Leave the burden to him, my last immortal. Shouldn't you be out there helping your people? Locking yourself up here isn't really doing much. My duty is here. The Sanctum needs to be kept in its peace and highness. There is a burial ceremony I need to prepare for. This civilization is after all held together by our customs and traditions. We can't allow the unholy mutations to desecrate them. I still feel that I should make myself useful. Can I help with anything else? Just tell me. Maybe with that search or something? No, no, that's... That concerns me and me only. Yes, I have to take care of that myself. Yet there is one thing I ache to be relieved of. It has enchained me here, with the sorrow. Our dear poor Barrow Bufus was killed by those furry beasts. As if I didn't have enough pain in my life lately. I have seen the Ratkins take him away. They were fighting over his golden armor. I feel each and every of his wounds as if they were inflicted on me. We weren't even left with a body to bury. Our poor Barrow will miss the privilege of returning to higher peace. Where did they take him? Finding him is the least I could do. That would bring me the highest joy. Sadly, I have no idea where they took him. I heard them shouting something about giving him a taste of his own medicine. Spider. Not that it would make things any more clear. Ah, oh. oh, poor Barrow. He's probably rotting somewhere in the sewers. Yep. Can you tell me more about Barrow Buffus? It might help with locating his remains. He had respect for the ways of Naboru and strived for knowledge. He always supported the Keepers, abided by our guidance. He repented for the sins of his younger days. His vanity, his pride, the fights in the arena. That's probably not gonna help. I know. 
I just can't think of anything else than how good he was. He even fed his retired pet spider. Others would have killed it. He gave it a home in the sewers and fed it fresh ratkin meat every day. Right. That's sweet of him. Not so much. Please, bring his remains to me. He deserves to ascend in peace. More than anyone else I know. I'll do it. It sounds like the right thing. How very good of you. May you be risen high and far. Okay. Not over here, nothing. Oh, that's some kind of a weird thing. <clears throat> All right. Really? Okay. What did I pick up? We've got poor invader helmet. Hey, there's killer rats everywhere. We need every good man. Could you maybe use that hammer to crack some skulls? I could. Yours would go first. Leave me alone. Don't tell me you're afraid of rats. You? Such a brawny brute? No. It's just not my war. Well, I don't have time for this lovely chit-chat. I need to find Her Majesty. Is she still around here? Good luck with that. The Queen's gone. Probably locked in her high castle. Like a different castle than this castle? Is the other one more castle-y or what? It's a citadel. A royal hideout next to the city. When the going gets tough, the nobility gets going and runs there to save their rich asses. Cowards and sissies. They don't mind spilling some blood for their noble causes as long as it's not theirs. How do I get there? I'm no expert, but through the gate to the city, and then through the gate to the citadel. Sounds about right. Have fun. It's a full lockdown here. My old pal and drinking buddy Cyrus is guarding the first gate. A good guy. He won't let you pass. You'd need a permit. Well, can I get a permit? Gracchus issues them in the main keep, so probably not. He's just like the rest of them, coward. I have news of utmost importance, probably connected to this war. Yeah, right. Well, I don't care. I've told you already, it's not my war. How can you say that? It's not my war either. I've been on this planet for literally one day. One day? That's really what you think? Well, that's funny. Never mind, go on. Still, I've chosen to fight for what I feel is right. Protect Her Majesty. Protect the Order. See my war tattoo? I'm a veteran. I did my fair share of Queen protecting and rat killing back in the day. And what good did that do for me? I knew a guy with a tattoo like yours. He didn't end up well, I must say. What? I highly doubt that. Only our Tuberni had it. Have you heard the tales about the third Tuberni? First century of the fifth Coho? We laughed together, we drank together, we fought together. Bufus, our captain. Those were the days. Now there are only three of us left. Me, Cyrus, 
and Tobias. Ooh. And we can all take good care of ourselves. I'm sorry to say, but Tobias is dead. What? How? I don't believe that. Obviously, he took part in some plot against Her Majesty and... Tobias would ne'er do that. You liar. It might have been a misunderstanding then. Her Majesty wanted to investigate further, but then the rats attacked. Stinky rats. It's always them. They took everything from me. Because of them, I've lost my wife. I've lost my smithy. They took Barrow Bulfus. And now they took my best friend. I had no idea you and Tobias were so close. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. Well, everybody dies, right? Yeah, right. Absolutely everybody. We weren't getting any younger. Me a drunkard, Tobias a cripple, and Barrow Bufus could barely walk the last few days. Still, he didn't deserve that death the rats brought him. He was always kind to me. My first commander, my last harbour, and a stable source of money and liquor. Sorry for your loss, again. This loss is even greater than you think. With Tobias, I've lost only a friend. But Barrow Bufus was wearing the armour I made for him when the rats took him for good. I know nothing will give me back my friend nor my Barrow, but it would be great to at least have the armour back. It's my finest work. The sturdy armor, the sleek trousers, the noble helmet, the snug boots and the nimble gloves. My five golden wonders. Could you find it for me? Five pieces of armor scattered around the battleground. I'll see what I can do, but no promises there. Actually, why didn't you make a golden shield too? What nonsense. Clearly you don't know anything about the noble art of metallurgy. Well, I did notice some of the shields appear to be made of metal. Metal shields? Nah, don't be silly. They're wooden shields painted metallic. What would people say if we had metal shields? Don't make me laugh. So you were a blacksmith, a painter, a carpenter? What? Metal shields? Oh my. All the shield and weapons experts out there would make fun of us for ages. There we go. We can. Add, uh, this is what I was waiting. You're not as skilled as actual buttons, so you need more materials. Wood, iron, bronze, easy to obtain. So if you you can upgrade things by yourself if you want, but if you go to him, don't even bother. Not going anywhere. Only place I'd go is. Don't even bother. Not going anywhere. Well, I don't. Is she? Good luck with. Like. It's just when the go coward. How do I get? I'm no. Sounds mild. Well, Grack. I have. Yeah. Well, I don't care. Don't even bother. Not going anywhere. There it is. Only Shop. place I'd go is to my old smithy. Okay, so we don't have enough for that. We really don't have enough for that. That looks like that heals. <clears throat> I want to keep that. Twenty seven primary attack. Okay, and upgrade. So we got our armor here. Do you want to upgrade your Helbrick armor? So you look over here, and it's going to take a point, uh, half a thing of leather. Uh, armor, but then it bumps everything, as you can see. This is some shit armor. What about this? Uh, we need the metal ore. Okay. That take that to 249.
Then we've got the electricity one. That'll take that to 270 versus currently we're only at 242. Then you can go through and you can start dismantling things. No, let's see. Out of mana. But I can't use it still, huh? <clears throat> Okay, that one still let me pull heat on it. Okay. Anyways, folks, let me see if I can find a main area again. What's up, dude? How do you get up there? Oh, if you can get up onto that parapet, you could jump over there. Alrighty. So, we'll come back in the next episode go from here as always thank you for joining me and if you haven't and you're still here please subscribe to the channel i'm trying to hit 10,000 subs this year we're gonna kick the shit out of it so as always keep your heads down your blades of doom up and i'll see you again real damn soon